Islamabad, the coalition government on Thursday lifted the ban on the import of non-essential and luxury products, however, the restrictions on the import of completely built-up automobiles, mobile phones, and home appliances will remain in place. According to the Ministry of Finance, the decision was taken during the Economic Coordination Committee ECC, held under the chair of Finance Minister Miftah Ismail, in the wake of a substantial reduction in imports. During the meeting today, the Ministry of Commerce submitted a summary on prohibition slash complete quantitative restrictions on the import of non-essential and luxury items. Related items Toyota, Suzuki to partially shut Pakistan output over Forex, shortage issues All Pakistani banks refuse to open LCs for Russian crude oil import import ban, have Pakistanis developed an attitude problem to local products? The members were briefed that in order to curtail the rising, a ban on the import of about 33 classes slash categories of goods was imposed with the approval of the cabinet. Due to the decision, the overall imports of the banned items have shrunk by over 69%, from $399 4 million to $123.9 million, the statement read, mentioning that the ban has, however, impacted supply chains and the domestic retail industry. Furthermore, it should be noted that all held up consignments, except items which still remain in banned category, which arrived at the ports after July 1, 2022 may be cleared subject to payment of 25% surcharge. The government had imposed a ban on the imports of the more than three dozen non-essential and luxury items on May 19 as part of and to stabilize the depleting and rising import bill. However, it is worth mentioning that while the imports have shrunk, the widened to $2. Three billion in June. Moreover, they continued to deplete and fell below $9 billion as of July 22, while the is at an all-time low of 239. dollars 92 against the US dollar. Moreover, restrictions continued to be in place on the import of completely built-up automobiles, mobile phones, and home appliances, which led to Pakistan's two leading car assemblers to plan partial plant shutdowns due to the unavailability of raw materials amid restrictions.